Armature reaction. Armature reaction is very important term in generator. In this video, I am going to discuss what is armature reaction, what are the adverse effect of armature reaction, and how to get rid of this ill effect of cross magnetizing effect or armature reaction in generator. Friends, in generator there are two kinds of flux present. First is armature flux and second is main field flux. So armature flux distort beacon to main flux and this is known as armature reaction or cross magnetizing effect. In other way we can say the distortion of main field flux due to armature flux is known as armature reaction or cross magnetizing effect in generator. Let us know what are the adverse effect of this ill effect of cross magnetizing effect in generator. First of all, because of the main field will be distorted, so output of the generator will be reduced. And one more thing, the sparking would be there and the brush and commutator contacts in case of DC generator. Why the sparking could be there? Because of the distortion of main field, MNA magnetic neutral axis will be shifted somewhere else in direction of rotation of armature. The initial position that would be the parallel of main field flux of MNA magnetic neutral axis but because of distortion of main field flux MNA will be shifted somewhere else and as we know that the location of brush are based on MNA magnetic neutral axis. So it would be very tough to find out the exact position of the brushes as MNA magnetic neutral axis will be shifted somewhere else. So ultimately sparking could be there in on brush and commutator contacts. So because of sparking output of the generator will be reduced. So here two adverse effects we can see. First is the output of the generator will be reduced because main field will be distorted and second sparking would be there at the brush and commutator contacts and this is sparking may lead to the fire hazards. So this is also adverse effect because of cross magnetizing effect. So friends let us know how to get rid of this ill effect in generator. How to avoid the armature action in generators. There are two basic methods which we adopting in generators. First is compass anti binding and second is interpoles. Compass anti bindings are the bindings would be there at the main pole face. So three main things related to the compass and winding. First, the compass and winding would be series with the armature winding. Second, the compass and winding would be at the main pole phase. And third one, the current flow into the compass and winding would be just opposite to the current flow into the armature winding. So whatever uh, flux will be generated, field will be generated because of the compass and winding it will neutral to the main uh, armature flux. Compass ending winding flux will neutral to the armature flux. So our main field flux will be resumed and main field will be resumed. The intensity of main field will be resumed and output of the generator will increase. So that is the first method. This is the first method to avoid this cross magnetizing effect in DC generator. Second is interpole. This method is the most satisfactory method to avoid this ill effect in generator armature reaction. So interpoles, interpoles are the small poles lies between two main poles. Few important things related to the interpoles and they are interpoles always will be lies between two main poles and the current flow into the interpole windings would be just opposite to the current flow in armature winding. One more important thing related to the interpole. The polarity of interpole would be just same as ahead of main pole in the direction of rotation of armature. Again I am repeating. The polarity of interpole would be same as just ahead of main pole in the direction of rotation of armature. So friends, these are the two main methods by which we can avoid this ill effect in generator. First is compass and winding and second is interpoles. But interpoles are the most satisfactory method to avoid this cross magnetizing effect. As the winding material are costly, so compass and winding rarely used. Mostly compass and winding are not being used. 
only interpoles are used in generators to avoid this armature reaction. So friends that was the armature reaction which is really very important term related to generator. So friends let's meet in new video till then you keep watching everything today. You take very good care of yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you.